talking right now I'm talking about spaghetti meatballs and you know, you know shit doo doo feces caca honey nut cheerios Can't even name myself. That's a big ass house. something funny <laughs> are we poor <laughs> this are you serious Why is this music so loud? Good thing that that was loud as fuck and I couldn't hear it. Thank you for that bit. Uh, is this supposed to be crazy? Whoa. I was busy tweeting on Instagram your stream. The blue line is... The blue line is up my ass. What blue line, ma'am? the fuck did they fix that? Uh, 
Oh, the blue. I don't know no damn PUBG. <laughs> I think I know that. Also, you paid for this, didn't you? I saw that it was fucking 999. Excuse my French. Sweet ass fucking room. Mom did a good job cleaning my room. You should have cleaned your own room, my guy. It was come. It was it was come. That's what it was. Your sneaky snake is what you are. <laughs> what? The train. And then he drowned and died. What? What is this fucking persona? Oops. Did you really want me to play this? Grab, yes, grab the iconic toast and run up the 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 house, introducing yourself. Explore a little. Oh, okay. They could have easily just drawn this out instead of describing it to me. Oh god, Jesus Christ. What the fuck? The little thingies don't pop up unless I'm blind. Nope, they don't pop up. Well, we're gonna keep going. At least the sun works. Out of the river. She never stood there much in front of the care in the world, frozen in time. What? You, what? Why would you say that? Shoot, shoot, shut up. <laughs> well, that's how she gets kidnapped. That's how bad things happen when you just say, ha ha ha. He just told you he, he's a, a serial rapist. How, what? in a man or a man as in a, a man in drag I'm G -G -G Chin that, that's your name Chin
I bet you this is where he used to... No, I was like, what the hell? He used to do this when he was a young lad, probably. A non, a female. A furry? Oh, a furry can be a boy or a girl. A blob? You have the same fucking outfit. I'm reading all- you're out of your mind if I'm gonna read all this. I'll be sore at the end of it I'm playing the game. Because it seems good and weird if you don't recognize the female uniform. Ah ha ha ha, right. Though, to be honest, today is my first day. So you're the first girl I've seen without wearing that uniform. Oh, so you really are a stalker. Ellipses. I choose to ignore that one. You wouldn't mind me waking. Oh, you wouldn't mind me walking to school. Walking with me to school, would you? Otherwise, I think I might get lost. Let's get moving, shall we? Bitch. What? What? So this is a place, huh? No shit. Yep, it is. It doesn't seem so bad, actually it's kind of cozy. In fact, it'll be a welcome change for my last school. This music is gonna give me Ajita. The peaceful atmosphere, the scenic views. I think I'm being to like this place already. Is this the first time that she, oh wait, no, this isn't. This is his talking. Yes, this school is surprisingly nice. Chin looks around as the other students starting to pour into the school. Is something wrong? Is this shoot? Mm. I was about to say something. Who am I in game? Some generic anime man. Oh, it's nothing. Listen, I have a club meeting, so I have to go now. How do you have a club meeting the second you get into school? Makes no sense, ma'am. So I want to share around, but him, that one. He looks like um, Lelouch from Code Geass. Which I apologize. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. You seem not fuck. Why do they keep double clicking? Why am I just in here? I gotta go find my. Well, is it just me? Can I fit right? This should be it. Nope. Wait a minute. I should save, shouldn't I? Run, host them girls. Uh, question open. It's the girl from Doki Doki no Literature Club. <laughs> Twain tail girl. Twin tail girl. Good morning. Good morning. You're the new student, <laughs> right? Yeah, that's me. This is a, this is a class. For, what? This is a class. For, so this is the right class after all, huh? May I come in? No shit. That's not so fast. You just have to. S oh, oh, I'm sorry. No, come with me. I'll take you there. Why do I have to stop by the office? I'm Megumi, the class rep slash student council president. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. She has the same chest piece as the other one. It's nice to meet you. I know. So that way, that means I still have my mama. What do you mean, what brings you to- Because I moved here. Damn it, I keep double-clicking. I said that my mom was really spontaneous. Laughing my ass off, that's what he said. Oh, that must be fun. Marquee thingy. Not really. This is the first time we actually move on a whim. She just likes to go on this little weird trip every now and then. That's odd. Very weird trip. You don't look so good. Do you need to go to the nurse's office? I'm fine. I was just recalling some memories. Best left forgotten. <laughs> Evil. Benjaco, that's my face right now. It sounds spooky. Here, I'll put you. What's she gonna do? Embrace him. 
that, that's exactly what I, I'm assuming this is what it is. Because I have no idea what charm this game has. Wow. What's going on here? I already thought this girl was a little off. She used to hug someone she just met. Make him let go me while blushing and backed away a little. Sorry if I made you uncomfortable. She, thanks for molesting me, I guess. It was a bit awkward. But who the right man would complain about a cute, busty girl hugging them? I would. Check, please. Me. Hello. Hey there. Me. Open box. I have some fun with it, boy. I'm laughing over here. Why? <laughs> this is literally... No. Ugh. Anyway, here we are. We were walking all this time, I guess. I have to go back to class now. So you'll have to go in by yourself. You just have to do some paperwork. It shouldn't take long. I should have done this before coming to school. Ah, sure. She swayed back and forth a little bit. She's a whole world. <laughs> it does. Did that really just happen? Meeting a family friend on the way to school is one thing, but being hugged out of nowhere mere minutes after first meeting someone, huh? Oh, wow. More of a Megumi is one who hugged me, so. I wish I could so embarrassed. A friendly girl like her probably hugs everyone, right? Because she uh, throws that around. That is the perfect What the fuck is that? I'm an emo. Who the hell goes to sun school to sunset? You're out of your mind. She didn't take long, she says. Who is she? Oh, the girl. Honestly, I got up early after my first day of school, and yet I still didn't even get to attend class today. Are you serious? Speak of the devil. What the hell? What is that on her head? What? Hey, hi, Daikun. I keep double clicking. Forgive me. What? Is she a furry? I don't think I've never been interested in such activities. What, really? It's this? Hmm. What do you mean her ears drop down? Did I miss one important key string of words? What? Is this... What? I love to have you. Is she a dog? Is this a furry? Oh my god, if this is a furry game. No. It shouldn't be for me to from the walls to learn me if it's just such servitude. No, they can't be it. It's far more likely that she fell in love with me at first sight, right? Nobody wants your D that bad, my guy. I have a particular reason to refuse. She perked right up. I think about it, okay. Yes, absolutely. I won't be sure about it anymore today. So you sure to make me sure to give it, give it, give it, give it a thought or two, okay? Sure. Okay, my quest shall continue tomorrow. Okay, bye, you fucking weird girl. We can be way goodbye and walks away cheerfully. She slid across the screen and opacity away. She, yeah, she has ears, and nobody mentions that unless I missed it. Mm. 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 I'm gonna wait how much that's the long way around. I don't want it to get mugged, you know? It was sunset at the school. And now it's mid afternoon here? <laughs> Please. I was walking along the road and noticed the same girl from this morning standing at the same spot. Oh, it's her. What's her name? Chin? <laughs> right? Talk to. Oh, hell yeah, I'm leaving. I'm gonna be a bitch. Perhaps I shouldn't. She shouldn't deserve her. That's when I walked away. Actually, I should have talked to her. <laughs> Mother, I am home. Welcome, father unit. Welcome home, Hiddy. Hiddy. 
I was cool. I couldn't tell you I didn't have any classes today. I did meet some interesting characters, though. So it wasn't a complete waste. You made friends already? That's wonderful, of course. Did you expect any less? I'm a boss, after all. I'm not sure if I'd say we're friends just yet, but if believing that makes mom happy, then so be it. You know, crazy skydiving mom. That crazy mm -hmm. Anyway, what's for diner? She slithered in my room. Interesting. I made some fried fish. I hope you're hungry. I left the bones in. Sounds good to me. See, he likes it. I'm. It may not be my favorite, but I'm not supposed. I'm not stupid enough to bite <laughs> the hand that feeds me. My mother and I are doing it together the rest of the night past peacefully. Look at that tree. Look at that light. Oh. I cooked it in my vabob. <laughs> vabob. Look, he has an entry. Look. Mm, kill the time. He's gonna masturbate. Nah. Uh, who the hell goes to sleep that quick? Yes. 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 How did she find? Okay. Good morning. I <laughs> already I haven't started monologue, model monologuing yet. Oh, that's not the problem here. How does Magoo know where I live exactly? Good, good morning, Magoom san I wasn't expecting you to see you early. Do you live nearby? I live in the apartment complex, a bit further down the road. Down there. Alright, I'm gonna have to take those dog ears out of my brain for a sec because nobody, it was just ignored. You sure seems engineered. She's fucking crazy. She's kind of adorable. My ass. <laughs> hey, what are you laughing at? Look at my traditional anime <laughs> face. I just remembered that joke again. You and your jokes. If they're so funny, why don't you share them with me? I'd rather not. Ah, oh, you're no fun. Alright, here he goes. At least I'm gonna suck another certain someone. But Chinsan may say otherwise. Forget it, let's hurry up and go to school. The class rep shouldn't be late, you know. Oh shoot, you're right, let's go. You know me, class rep and all. Were her nails? After being dragged all the way to school, found the goon to our class. We entered, however. I couldn't clearly hear two people arguing. I could he clearly hear two people screeching. Good morning, everyone, said me. Oh no, it's this bitch. Brunette girl. Humph. And, but that's saying the brunette girl stormed off good. I wonder what that was about. As much as I would love to stay in class and ignore everybody in this whole game, Maybe that was a fuss about our oh, shit. I should have met the other character if there was one. Where did she go? I'm sure that girl stormed off this way. I can't see her anywhere. I was to locate the girl by the hallways. I looked by the window towards the courtyard. Surely enough, I made a spot of the girl who was sitting on a bench by a tree. I haven't seen many students go to that side of the school. You know, <laughs> that side. Perhaps I should go and introduce myself. <laughs> I'm sure there's leeway, <laughs> I hope. Well, let's, let me just, let me, oh yes, yeah, okay, nice to meet you, man. yeah, okay. We're gonna get to the, the P. Shut the f- I don't know where, I teleported. UE. Rio. If I hit- We'll see what this this thing looks like. After all, oh my god! <laughs> Look at that photo. 
photoshopped the smile. This is not anything. This is nothing. That's a girl with short hair. Yes. Let's be friends. Fuck you! Oops, clicked outside. Me and you friends, what do you say? No, this guy's just written. Nope, this guy seems way too pushy. Maybe being just desperate. You don't even know who I am. Well, around the ladies, you're actually a cur. Excuse you, says this one. I meant that it's a good thing. How could I possibly interpret what you said is a good thing? Uh oh, this could be trouble. I should get out of here. I should skedaddle. He's already chasing a fury. I don't want me to be turned off, too. I better change the rich social before the rich gets close. So, you say you want to be my friend because I know my way around the ladies, but weren't you getting along with you just a minute ago? If you call getting smacked in the head, getting along with them, sure. Ass friends, butt buddies, butt pirates, smacked in the head. What could you have said to get her at that mad? Not that I couldn't guess given how quickly he pissed off Hatchy. Nothing really. Yui actually transferred here last week, but every time I talked to her, she seemed to get mad. Maybe you shouldn't say anything to upset her. I didn't say anything this time. Well, Magoon said you enjoy pissing her off. And I get the distinct feeling that everyone this guy says pisses off someone off. What the fuck? I'm going actually getting a stroke. Fake nudes. Fake nudes and open bobs. What Megum? Did you really say that? Isn't it true? No, I don't enjoy it. I don't enjoy doing that. I'm not a jerk. You know. She doesn't like anything I say. Fancy that. I don't believe you. You must have done something. Nothing, I swear. Kind of think of it. Maybe she's still mad. What I did on the first day here. What did you do? You threw her down the fly upstairs? Magumi shot it. Megumi shot a deadly glare at Ruru. Sheesh, what the heck did you do? Well, it was like this. Please just play a video. Son of a bitch. Everyone, this is the new student I mentioned earlier. You eat. Please get it off. As the teacher just received the entire class from me to silent. Here, you didn't say a word. She just stood there and during the stairs of the entire class. Wow, look at that fucking hair, said the boy. Someone get the fire extinguisher. No, call the fire brigade. Remember, duck and cover, stay low to the ground and try not to breathe. Do the carpet match the drapes? Ha ha ha, I'm very funny. Jesus. Nobody dare laugh. Nobody dare to laugh with Rio or at any comments of their own. <sighs> Whoops, I clicked away. Rio nervously looked around the classroom for approval no matter how. Which way he turned, nobody made a sound. Get it? Because fire is red. Get it? Well, fire is not brown. It's brown. Ooh. Please enlighten me. No, it's nothing. It was just a joke. A joke. I see you think you're funny. And then she says the worst and word that she can possibly think of. And no, you're not. No, I was just, you know, breaking the ice. Cause he get it, cause he's fire and ice. So you think you're so funny, do you? you... She's got a rock and choice. Is the teacher just gonna let them fight? Don't lie to me, Joker boy. I'm like better than you, exactly. Anyone, please. Everyone looked away, including the teacher. Are you all pussies? I'll show you what's funny, you little. That's what happened. She shoved the broomstick up his ass and broke it. No kidding, can still see the fear in his eyes. I'm sure not to make fun of your hair color then. Good idea. Just said we finished talking your teacher into the classroom. Yeah, she, she threw camera angles at him. We better head to our seats now. I bet you he sits right behind me or something. It was just momentarily. Got 
Yeah. I can take this so far. I have to do it across the bridge, through the alley, or past Megumi's apartment block. All decisions, decisions. I'll guess I'll go by the bridge since I didn't get a chance to do this party. You probably do, and I won't do it. I'm going to stay asexual this whole game. And be very, very crude to these people. This is a really nice view. A great bridge to jump off of. I can see why Jinsu likes this place. <laughs> As I approach the bridge, I can hear the soothing sound of the riverbed. Just like in that poem thing that happens every time he falls asleep. And then once again, I saw her. Hey, Miki. What? <laughs> Misaki. Yeah, Burf, yeah, what? The girl looked at me, Paulos. Why would you call me that? Just call me shit, sir. Okay, there. Get that tentacle. You got here quickly. School only just ended. Today, I just wanted to rest to look at the scenery. Oh, didn't looking at this place be a bore? If I can stare out into the sun, huh? You'll burn your eyes that way. Shin simply looked out the sky focused on the city beyond the horizon. Maybe I should sit here relaxed too. The last couple of days have been pretty eventful, so I should chill out while I can. Mind if I stay a while? Hmm, not at all. Oh wait, she's smiling. Never mind. As we stared into the sunset, I'm allowed my mind to go blank. And that's when it happened. I felt the urge to vomit. I felt through my new life truly was what? I felt as though my new life truly was the beginning what the fuck is happening what the fuck is happening no was that just a f opening what the hell I'm triggered. This is not an anime. There's literally two pictures of each person and they're flashing around, wasting that moment. Oh look, there's a different one. Mm -hmm. They don't explain where she had fucking dog ears. There's... What the fuck are they doing? They look exact. Who the f Oh, that's me and the other one. They look exactly the same. Get it, Shiro? Because she's white and everything about her is white. Get it? White? Shiro? White? Get it? Oh, what the fuck? What the hell? Oh my fucking god, what is this? I can't blast this as loud as it goes. <laughs>
like you're gonna jump to it, I will do it. Give me your hand, I'll help you up. She can get up all her own. It's 2018. I grab Chin's hand and pulls her to her feet. Come on, I'll walk you home. It is it is pretty dark out here. It's okay, you don't have to. Okay, bye. No, he doesn't. I'm pretty insistent. I know you won't take no for an answer after he made that stalker remark. Put the record for the first one, let you walk with me halfway there. So that way you only have to walk a halfway amount. You, you see? It's okay, let me walk you with the whole way there. Please, head deck. I don't want to inconvenience you too much. Chin seems pretty adamant about this. Alright, okay, that's fine. Be careful. Chin turned around and we started walking, dabbing as we went. I just realized there's no f fucking music coming out of this thing. After walking, Chin halfway to her house and began heading home myself. As I walked toward my street, however, I realized I was not alone. No! I <laughs> Uh. You can take my money, please. Just don't hurt me, cunt. Huh? Megumi, is that you? I don't know what you've turned to... What? I don't know why you've turned to a life of crime, but please spare me. A life of crime? How rude. All I did was call out to you, asshole. Maybe so, but it's pretty sure that you woke up the whole neighborhood in the process. Use your inside voice, okay? You idiot. Oh, I suppose you're right. Well, I guess I can turn this off since that music started fucking playing. Sorry, I just got a little too excited. I was expecting to see you out this... I wasn't expecting to see you out this late. Damn it, I missed it. What are you doing out here? Girl, shouldn't be out here. What's up? What? Because I can protect myself. No one would want to kidnap me. I'm annoying. Uh, fuck you. What the fuck was that noise? The fuck was that noise? Okay. I already got... What? Yes. Sorry, but, you know, <laughs> I don't give a fuck. You don't need to apologize. Yeah, you literally said it's uh, this is old-fashioned. So you can go the hell right back home, a girly. Damn, even her near, even but ever energetic move can get like this, huh? Yeah. Ew, no, look, <laughs> look, like gonna suck that dick, Mickey. If you really want me to, I could stay. No, I said no. Okay, good. I sure you look pretty upset. Haha, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm not upset. I guess I'm just tired. That's all. Haha. <laughs> Megumi smiled at me, but it seemed like she was forcing herself. If you say so. I know she's a murderer. In this case, I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Yep. Good night, you f stalker. Night. I broke her heart, and I stepped on the pieces. I river danced on her heart pieces. I waved goodbye to Megumi and started walking away. Man, I know she said that was fine, but I still feel bad for doing that. And it's me here, your subconscious, saying... Fuck that. Way to go, Jay. You're gonna break her ass. She's gonna shit up. She's gonna shit on your place. Good, and I'll push push it into the garden and it'll fertilize all the flowers. She should be fine, though. It's not a big deal. Question mark. Right? Megumi said she can take care of herself. She did say that with her own fucking mouth. I'm sure they're just overthinking tits. Tits. <laughs> Mother San, I'm home. I hope she lights it on fire. Good. I'll kick it. Mother. I walked to the kitchen and found a note on the table. I already made dinner, but you were late. Just heat it up in the microwave, asshole. I love ya. Well, that's considerate. Is she, uh, co yes, it's considerate. I guess mom is too busy working f for us to have dinner tonight. Oh, well, thanks for the feast and parental unit. 
was that half as lame as it sounded. No, that was cool. I feel nothing to these characters. She probably did kidnap her. I heat up the food and return to her room after eating. It was bloody sausage. As soon as I finish eating, I decided to spend the rest of the evening playing video games. Minecraft? <laughs> FTW. True to form. However, I quickly lost track of time. What time is it? I turned away from the TV, looked at the clock. Megumi was standing there with a knife. Oh, 3 a.m. already. How is that even possible? It's like every time I touch the controller, time goes fast, but I actually get some sleep before the sun rises. Megumi just checked me to kill you. I'd be concerned if you felt the same way, so I'm gonna have to kill you. No, you no, you don't have to listen to her. She's a, a ghoul. You can't trust ghouls. Is this a weekend? No, this is Thursday. You are crazy if I'm gonna spend, stay up at the wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa! All right, summer vacation. Video game section. Beep 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 beep. Click. Damn it, alarm! Why do you hate me so much? I can't even open my eyes properly yet. If you expect me to get up, I was in a coma. I should get out of bed. Though. This is only gonna become harder the longer I stay put. On the other hand, this is pretty darn comfortable. <laughs> Maybe five more minutes. No, if I fall asleep now, there's no power in the world that would ever wake me up again. Get out of the bed, Hideki. This video game police. We heard. We heard a rush for hitting on lollies. Listen, I'm trying to get away from every single body. If anything, they should be here arresting them. After somehow getting the best of my inner demons, I went downstairs and started eating breakfast with Mother Son. Mother Son, you know you shouldn't stay up all night playing video games when you have school. Huh? What makes you think of playing video games? I'm a responsible man, actually. Offended, Mother. I heard you shout and you kept stomping your feet on the ground. It was a really hard boss fight, okay? Just try not to sleep in class. I would never do that. Anyway, I'll be going out. See you after school. Facts. Bye, honey. She sounds like a piece of paper. The mother is as, is as, is as interesting as a piece of paper. Even though she skydived with him. I continued walking down the road leading to my new school until I heard that I knew the path getting onto the bridge. It's his favorite alley. Is it weird that I have a favorite alley? <laughs> You're about to have a favorite glory hole. It's really his father dressed up as a woman. Ew. Ew. <laughs> no, I'm normal. Completely normal. Everyone likes alleys, especially when they lead to beautiful scenery. It's so perfectly natural for me to want to pass through there and go by that bridge once more. Fuck you, bitch. I'm going straight to school. Even so, I should go straight to school. I don't want to be late. Yeah, get out of here, chin. As I approach my classroom, I hear footsteps creeping on me from behind. Let me guess, it's chin. Or better yet, you know the one. Megumi-san. Or better yet, you know the one. Fire hair girl. Or yet, you better know the, the boy. I'm not here for no lolis. Lolis can go fuck off. I swear off. Of all the stalkers I've had, it has to be, or maybe some new character, that white one, Shiro. Damn it. Soup Hideck. Oh, hey there, um, Megumi. You're actually looking feminine this morning. Come on, it's me, your best friend, Ryu. Shut the fuck up. We're not friends. Did Ryu just support himself, my best friend? Alright, oh, I remember you. You're the guy who keeps fucking you. E. I only have one stalker. Me too. Hey, don't bug her. I just <laughs> talk to her. There's a difference. Speaking of Yui, where is she anyway? Your mind jumps straight down from Megumi to Yui. I knew you were a lady killer. <laughs> but his music is so fucking loud. But yeah, I don't know. She didn't come to class today. Oh. Even though I saw her this morning, she's probably in the courtyard again. 
Oh, well, let's go ahead and set before the teacher arrives. Without further ado, we walk to our seats. Oh, I've got to show you this. This cool new manga. Oh, just as we floated the idea, I heard someone shout my name. Fuck! She is a dog! Why, wait. Whoops. Hideki. What the? What did I say about your indoor voice? Don't be such a downer. Please tell me this isn't dreaming or something. You should be happy that I'm excited to see you. Pouty Hachi. That's rather adorable. That's fucking stupid. And she's having a cuckoo girl excitedly call your name. I gotta admit, that's pretty bad. Really bad feelings all around. <laughs> You're right, I am happy, said Hideki, not me. Really, that's great, my ears pounded up in, in, in happy. You know, I was thinking that if you join the student council... She... Oh, what the hell? Aha, I found it. Oh, hello there, Megum. Hello, Ryu. Look, sorry to tell you this, but Hideki and I were having in the middle of a boring conversation, so please do not bother him with your icky manga. Is that what she fucking said? Icky. I'll have you know the best. <sighs> that these manga have really good stories and character development, not like this fucking game. Roy diddles her biddles. Diddle her biddies. <laughs> Yeah, sure, you read School Girls vs. Zombies for the Flock. I don't think I've read that one. It sounds stupid yet interesting. Not you too, Hideki. Ah, forget it. I can review it if I wanted to. I just don't have the energy in me today. Now that you mention it, you do look pretty gay. I mean, tired. Actually, you've been looking tired a lot lately. That would be all the late night gaming sessions where I pawn noobs at games on Minecraft servers. Ah, uh, yeah, I've been staying up late. Study? Oh, come on, Hideki, that was pathetic. Nobody about that. Just then, our teacher walked in the classroom, and I bet you can romance the teacher, too. But seriously, the days are just sleep. Should I take a. Uh, uh, mu Muzzle, stay awake. No, I should stay awake. I don't want to get in trouble. And the mother would beat the shit out of me if I did. I can do this. Why would he give me that choice? I would probably got diddled when I fell asleep. Phew, that was difficult. <sighs> I can't believe I managed to stay awake throughout the entirety of the boring history class. Maybe I should have taken a nap instead. If I stay awake any longer, I'm going to pass out. I need some caffeine. You know, some of that crack. After entering the cafeteria, I bought a can of iced coffee to help make me up. The second I opened the can, however, something in the roof caught my attention. It's that girl that's about to kill herself. That's why it sounds like someone's up there. <sighs> but isn't the roof off on the students? And I haven't seen any construction workers or anything. Hmm. I'm going to go up there and investigate. My curiosity had gotten the best of me. And before I knew it, I was heading towards the stairs. Man, these stairs are way longer than I expected. Someone as tired as me can definitely not be climbing stairs. Well, would, if it's already that tiring, I would give up immediately. Then again, maybe this will get my the blood pumping and, and help me wake up. Okay, ten laps up and down the stairs. Spread out over the next few years, of course. Anyway, let's see what's going on up here. I grabbed the handle at the door at the top of the stairs and opened it. It's black haired, red glasses girl. Well, the roof is bigger than I expected. I looked right on the roof and saw a girl sitting next to the fence. I have watched enough anime to know where this is going. What the fuck? Hey there. Oh, it's Shiro. Huh? You're talking to me? No, I'm talking to the fence behind you. Either that or I'm talking to myself. That's right. Hello. Now, second that, I don't know this girl. I mean, we've never spoken, but I'm certain that she's in my class. How can you not notice the albino in your class? You're in my class, right? I'm sorry, I don't remember your name. It's Shiro. You Hideki, aren't you? Hideki. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is kind of awkward. You remember my name, but I remember yours, even though 
I'm the one who approached you. Haha, <laughs> sorry. I guess it's to be expected though since you're retarded. <gasps> no. Since you have the whole class full of new names to remember. You got that right. Girly. So what are you doing up here all alone, if you don't mind me asking? She's holding her precious ju jewels is what she's holding. Why does everyone look more like a main character than you? Because they need to make the characters more interesting. You're not supposed to care about yourself. I look like a background character that's not even shaded incorrectly. I'm not the fan of Carter Placer, so I come up here. As you can see, not many people come to the roof except for a suicidal victim. That's lonely. How did you get up here in the first place? Shouldn't the door be locked? Well, you see, I know how to make keys through whittling. If I tell you where to keep it to yourself, uh, sure. You promise? This is serious. Yeah, I promise. I. Saying stupid shit. Oh, look, she laughed. Show emotionless. How did you know which key it was? Continued eating. What were he eating? Yeah. Anyway, I like to stay longer, but <laughs> I think classes are about to begin. Oh, you're right. We should get going. She put her food in her vagouche and we stood up. Are you ready to return? Yeah, let's go. We both walked black inside and she locked the door. At least she locks the door. Alright, home at last. Time to eat, game, maybe even sleep. No. No, no, no. You're still here. Damn it, let's hang out. I was... Just no. I don't know about that. The first person to invite me over to their house is a guy. This is not fulfilling the high school life I had imagined. You're fulfilling some high school life. Come on, man. We're super best friends. Yet we never hang out. Sounds pretty desperate. He must want me to come over. I guess it's the assessor so I'm his only friend. His, non his only non-fiction fan. I mean, let's do this. I didn't have a choice in the matter. Awesome. Where do you live exactly? My house is very far from here. It's about a 10 minute walk. Let's go. I'm right behind. I literally have no choice. Get it? LOL? Cause he doesn't want to be there? Following what's his name's lead, he started walking down the road to his house. <laughs> kept talking the whole time, but I really wasn't keeping up with him. I kept switching subjects every few minutes. Oh, he kept switching subjects every few minutes. This guy's pretty annoying, but at least he means well. This golden sunset, is the sun exploding on the house? Here we are. After a shot, well, we are start. <laughs> We arrived at Rio's place. It looks like a normal house, as expected. Nothing in particular stands out. Rio doesn't look like a rich guy, so it's family party average. <laughs> like mine. Actually, I'm better. After greeting Rio's mother, the two of us headed into his room. Oh, God. Nice place. I like your room. I thought in my head and didn't say out loud because, you know, I'm not doing that. Is that Mikasa and is that freaking Annie? on the desk. It's weird to see someone with more video games than I have. Hey, that's where all my money goes. What money? No kidding. Ryu sat on his bed and I started walking around the room checking out his stuff. You really have interesting manga anime collection. Super Magic Boys Trilogy. Hey, don't judge your best cover. They're pretty awesome. Sure. Forget about that, let's play something. Diddle fingers. I hope it's not Super Magic Girls or something. What? Of course not. As he said that, I caught Ryo hiding something beneath his pillow. Busted. I have the latest indoor... What? Indoor fighting sis game, we can play that. 
Oh, I love Inno Fighter save. Oh, I love Indoor Fighter. I think it's a great way they. F I think it's great how they fight and nicely furnish homes and get bonus points for not trashing the place. It's certainly much more entertaining than fighting outside, like fighting outside, like on the street or something. Get it? Like you know, like Street Fighter fighting on on the street. Don't be silly. That's just dangerous. Get it? Because it's Street Fighter. Do you understand the joke that they are making here? All right, pop it in, let's play. Not your penis, of course, the game. It's nighttime. That is definitely a, a PNG of a pop figure of Mikasa and Annie. He's really good at this. I didn't expect that as he pulled out. You're pretty good too, as he put it in. <gasps> I let out all my anger in these types of games, so I think it's time well spent. Anger, you've seen that the counter gets angry because he's playing the games, obviously. On the counter, I actually get angry pretty easily. I see. That would explain why he doesn't have any friends. Huh, you learn something new every day. I should keep that in mind. Yeah. Awkward silence. I punch your shoulder. Why'd you do that? Hmm, it didn't work. You don't sound angry. I wouldn't get angry or something like that aside so oh well it was worth a shot still blanking at least i've been mean, amused by my antics see he's triggered anyways i should start leaving home now you pussy huh why i told you i'm not mad at you it's not that we've been here for quite a while haven't we we were both at the clock i didn't mention it i guess you're right what time is it we should hang out like this more often the morning would have this morning I would have rejected the idea, but now. Yeah, you're right, actually. Have fun today. I'll see you later. See ya. Are you gonna walk me home? Oh, look, the little child didn't attack me this time. You allowed him to take you to his room. I didn't allow anything. This was all out of my hands. Hey, I'm back. Where have you been, you fucking ass? The second I walked to the door, my mother emerged with the word look on her face and a sickle upon her brow. I went to a friend's house. You had me all Rory Hideki. Don't we have cell phones in this time of day? We should have told me. Ah, oh, damn, I knew I forgot something. The whole reason mom bought me a cell phone was to avoid moments like this. Oh, look at that. Out of your hand and into your pants and into my anus and out of my mouth and into my mouth and into my anus and then back out my mouth and into my anus. I'm sorry, mother. But seriously, relax. You should stop worrying about me so much, idiot. I didn't want you to get hurt. So it's about that again, huh? I know you're worried about me because of what happened when I was young, but that accident was a long time ago. I'm not a kid anymore. I can take care of myself, even though I have amnesia. I don't want you to get all worked up like this, okay? Mom? Okay, I'll try. If it's good enough for me, if it's good enough for you. So what's for dinner, y'all, cool? Well, I'm sorry, I haven't had time to make anything. It's okay, I'll just make a sandwich. Alright, honey, I'll be in my room if you need me. Okay, mom, good night. I wonder what kind of sandwich you made. God, mom, let me live. Ugh. Yawn, I guess it's about time I get to bed. I was over at Rio Sister Sun at a time, and the constant in game shouting wore me out. I guess I'll consider my room energy for this weekend. What time is it? Oh, it's Friday. You should have spent the whole. F mm. It's Friday. It's gonna jump to Monday. Oh no. Wait, isn't there school on Saturday? There is school on Saturday. Bring, bring. What the heck? Who could be calling me at this hour? Actually, it's a good question. Not many people have my number since I really use my phone for calls. I picked up the phone and answered. It's the girl. How the fuck did he have my number? What?
What the hell? You could literally look at him through the window and say, LOL, you're lost, and then go back to sleeping. He looks like the, the main character from Sword Art, Sword Art Online. Yeah, but... Oh, you're a faggot. Oh, she brightened up. I thought you were back. Wait, what? What the f- this is- oh my god. <laughs> mother son over here making it all weird. <laughs> Just cut off some fucking- So him stalking you is bad, but the girl stalking you is not, even though the girl lives even closer to you than he does. Let's get going. Should I go back in town, right? No, not really. Not since I was a kid, at least. We'll have a nearby mall we can visit. Let's do that, because you're all the cool kids hang out. Nobody wants to hang out. This isn't like me at all. Without further in speculation, what's his name? And I walk into the mall. Hold the freaking horses. Bam. Since we arrived, the two of us had done little more than walk around exploring the surprisingly large complex. So far, this trip has been. I will get to go my way around, and I bet you the girl is there. There are a fair number of things stores around here. I can certainly see myself coming back with more. It's very crowded in here. I don't feel the need to rush around. You know, I have money. I don't have to window shop. I'm getting thirsty. You want a drink? He unzips his pants. Oh, he actually is going to buy it. Fucking course. Ooh. You turn around and begin to search the for a vending machine. Or you could just go to the store that's right there. Wait, why didn't he just go? Why didn't we just go together? I'm standing here waiting for Ryu while he's buying me something. It almost feels like... I uh, began to ponder my word, but let's shoot your hurts and call my name. No! What the fuck? Oops, I dropped everything. Yes. You said you said J. I say yes. How? Why? When? Calm down, Aki. Use your inside voice, okay? Don't you pull that shit on me. How's my digital boner? It's at a mild negative one. 
And that's another thing. Why do you keep swapping between Hideki, Aki, and Hikun? I feel like I'm having an identity crisis here. Oh, he No, we're not doing this. Don't be such a drama queen, you F word. That's a perfectly reasonable explanation for all of this. You see, first eye gets knocked out by him. Here you go, Hideki, and... Oh my, if it isn't this... C. If I knew you were here, I would have brought you one too. You can have mine if you want. No, thank you. Suit yourself, you dumb. I'm probably going to regret finding these flames, but... You can have some of mine if you want. I'd love some. What the hell, you agree to share? Here's without batting an eye. I guess I like his flavor better. We have the same exact flavor. I do this would happen. Sorry, Rio, this is your punishment for making me on such an ungodly hour. Come around. It's not a big deal. Everyone's out to get me. He's getting triggered. Ah, oh, cheer up, Rio. More importantly, look over there. Isn't that you? No, the one from, from, from the magazine. That's a bomb rusher. Should I lure Ryu into the lion's den? Yes. Why would he run over there? I thought we were all going over there. God damn it. Does he change nasty boy? What the hell do you mean? Look, he's, he's all wet, and the can is still on his head, too. The awk moment when another streamer asked me, and well, we will see each other again. <gasps> awkward. Oh, mother freaking awkward. Let me just do this real quick. Let me... There you go. You're back. Whoa! Let me see. You're back. Hey there, buddy. How did it go as he left? Actually went pretty well. Uh, what? She talked to me for more than two minutes. That's on the record. Oh, 
I never pitted a human being to this extent in my entire life. Well, that's good. Maybe next time you two can talk without drinks being spilled everywhere. One can only hope. At any rate, let's not bother her anymore. So what do you guys plan on doing now? I'm not sure if I just go on and hang around or something. Sounds fun. Can I hang around with you? Hey, stop eating up my heat time. I'm scraping the bottom of the barrel as it is, you know. Then you should be begging me to come along since it won't come if we're both here. Megumi, my friend, please do his dick and I the honor of escorting us as we patrol this fine establishment. I would be honored, kind sir. I would bolt out of there because these two are fucking stalkers. They didn't even, you didn't even get to pick them. They picked you. What the fuck is this motel? Yes. 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 <laughs> As the day dragged down, our outing came to a close. The three of us headed home. What is this? Or is this the apartments that she lives in? Rio, Rio separated from Megumi and I fairly quickly since we weren't far from his house. And Megumi and I to walk home alone together. You've been naughty. I have not been naughty. Yes, stalk me, Daddy. I love when you stalk me in a creepy motel. Fuck it. You're a joker, aren't you? Click. Today was today was surprisingly fun. Were you even that bad as I thought? Getting graped in the corner of the stairs. Huh. He might seem a bit peculiar, but he means well, if you say so. Pfft. Anyway, I have to go now. We should hang out like this more often. Hell the fuck no, we shouldn't. Yeah, I think so too. Girl, I'll still tomorrow night. Wait, tomorrow night? Tomorrow night what? Tomorrow's Saturday, Sunday. Oh, they see? There you go. It wasn't. She's obviously fucking stalking you, you dumbass. And your mom's gonna die off screen. What kind of candy? Cloak and taffy. After returning to my home last long at last. Okay, I remember in the kitchen. A man, I walked a lot today. How was your date? What? I mean, did you enjoy hanging out? Laughing my ass off? <laughs> LOL. Gay boy. LOL. Hmm. It was fun. We came across him with a friend of mine in town. Oh my, you've become so quite popular lately. Not really. You're being modest. You know that everyone loves you. Touches your bepis vigorous, vigorously or viciously. You're starting to embarrass me, Oh. Anyway, I'm exhausted. I'll go up to my room now and furiously masturbate. Don't you want to eat dinner first? You're right, I'll need the energy. Nah, we ate out. <laughs> right now, I don't want to see it. If she doesn't make a joke about that... Damn it. It feels so good to change one's clothes after a long day. I would seriously stay in these pajamas all day if I could. You could have did it, but you didn't do it. Because you got bitched into going to the mall. Damn you, society, you judgmental bitch. Yeah, fucking prick. What am I even reading? To fuck. I opened the window and looked outside. Megumi was standing out there with a crooked smile. She began twisting the doorknob across my house, and then I threw a, a brick at her brow. The view is nice as well as the view, but I didn't notice before, but I can see the river from here. And you're going to see the girl, and you're going to see, hmm, I, maybe I should go out there and, and annoy her. It's fun to change when there's no steam and stains on them. They probably were as they crusted on his pants. They're stuck to the side of his leg. What's a great sign? Somehow feels nostalgic as feelings of times past got the best of me. I saw a figure emerge by the river. Fucking called it. That's weird. Who could be there late at night? I kept staring at the unmoving figure, perhaps I'm just imagining things. I'm pretty tired, I thought maybe I should just go to bed. I walked over to her and made 
to my bed, lay down, close my eyes, and T posed across the floor. Sun. Ellipses times two times three. For how long have I been staring at this mirror? I don't know what it is, but today something feels wrong. He's pregnant. No, I'm sure it's nothing. I'll just go downstairs, have breakfast, and see where my day takes me. Nobody wakes up naturally and says, hmm, something's off without something not being off. So you're sick or something, my God. Or if his mom is dead. Mom, are you here? Nope. She's dead. I was just working in her room. I shouldn't bother her. Maybe we should check. Oh, cool. oh, fuck. That scared me. But no particular reason to hang out in the house. I'm going to the door and walk outside. They're really sparing. Use these sound effects. Rarely. To the well, the only fucking place I can go. I kind of feel like I could go there. I kind of feel like I have to go by there this morning. After seeing that silhouette last night, it's almost as if though something was calling for me. I turn right instead of walk the empty road. It's really quiet. The only thing I can hear is the wind blowing between the trees. There's nobody here. That's strange. I sh was sure I saw someone here. You saw someone there last night. Mm, is my boy getting into the game? <laughs> 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 That's my answer. <laughs> I walked over to the bridge and started looking at the river. This is so weird. Everything's way too quiet. I haven't come across a single person today. It was rather nice at first, but now it's just creepy. I kept staring at my own reflection in the water. Is it like the Spiral Town manga? What the fuck is going on here? Question mark, why don't you just let it go? Who said that? I looked around, but there was no one to be seen. I would never lie to you. Or would I? With no other human, I look back at my reflection. He didn't notice that his fucking turn tonight. What in the world is going on here? What's the point of thinking about it? It's better this way. What are you talking about? The silence, the emptiness, idiot. I haven't to worry about anything. I have no one left to hurt. Who are you? I am you, but stronger. The water's really nice. Down at the bottom, the cold, deep, dark river. Why don't you join me? As those words reached my ears, a hand came out of the water and started dragging me in. Hey, let go of me, Hannah said. Why are you fighting it? You know what's better for us. You know, me. Don't you trust me? It's you. I don't want this. The big ass teardrop. My body touched the cold water as I was dragged to the river. Shh, there's no use, but my whole body submerged into the water. I was sinking slowly into the depths of the river. I'm starting to run out of air, but in this dream, I don't think that I have, but I can breathe. In love with the Beppus, dead ass. B. There's nothing I can do. Is this it for me? <coughs> Don't worry, everything's gonna be alright, said me. Twenty nine days later. It's April, May, June. Yeah. Let go of me. Pant, pant, pant. I'm in my room. It happened again. The same dream. 
for the past month I've been having that dream on it all. It's horrible. It feels so fucking real. It makes me wanna puke. Why the hell am I being haunted by such a disturbing dream? Is this supposed to mean something? No, maybe I'm overthinking this. It was a dream after all. No matter how real it feels, it's just a dream after all. You know what I'm saying? It's not real. It's just a dream. You know, it's just some brain waves happening in my brain skull. So what do you think? Think about what? Your banana face? <laughs> Get out of here. Are you even listening to me? No, obviously. I saw you. Did you say something? Pink haired child. You're really out of today. Was it that dream again? Yeah, same as ever. With what? The ongoing torture my subconscious has been through. I felt like I had to confide in someone about the dream of mine. So you chose her? So because I didn't talk to that other girl the first more, she's, that's it, she's just dead ass and gone. You should have so much, I hate seeing you like this. It's just a dream, Aki, I can't hurt you. Yes, I can, idiot. You're right. Look, our teacher is here. Just focus on the lesson. You'll forget all about that dream in no time until, you know, class ends and I remember it again. She makes it sound so simple, dumb bitch. <gasps> Taking Mikumi's advice to heart, I kept my eyes on our teacher and before long, the lesson had begun. Give me the pepper. As the day dragged on, our lesson came to a close. I found myself strangely tired because, you know, learning. Yawn. These stress playing video games till five in the morning is I really I really, I really need to stop with these nightmares already I stood up and stretched my body oh well no point worry about that now more importantly with class over and class over for the time being what should I do with myself mm -hmm. asexual it's supposed to not it's I suppose it's not as though I need to do something <laughs> besides it's nice when the classroom is so empty and quiet who needs the outside world anyway idiot I sat on the I sat on one of the desks and looked outside all I did was sit there looking at the students walking Fuck shit. Looking at the students outside, talking, laughing with each other. Hideki, here comes the question mark. Oh, it's you. Damn it. What are you doing here all alone? I'm trying to avoid you, but here you come. So I guess it's white haired girl, brown slash red haired girl, and then my last choice was pink haired girl. I've made a huge mistake. I spent that class today. What about you? What are you doing here? I just have some work to get done here. Damn it. Go to the library. See? What's with the half ass lie? Megumi is definitely hiding something. And we still have. She's the only one here, so she has to be your favorite. Anyway, you still haven't given me an answer about joining my club. Hell the fuck no. You mean the student council? Yep, I'm not sure. It sounds like a lot, a lot of work. You don't need to do anything you don't want to. Cool, I don't have to do it at all then. Join the student council and so just any little club and not do anything. I don't know. I think I'll have to pass. But it would be something fun for us to do together. We can just hang around here during class. Once they come here, should be fine. Hmm. Come on, we have the class to rest until break ends. We can mess with these stuff like we're gods here. That's so fucking stupid. You expect us to do that? So Shinobu will suspect that that's what makes this a perfect plan. Get your heterosexual relations out of my face. Thank you. I was trying not to get in trouble. You're still a fairly new student here, and I have a reputation to uphold. Oh, come on. That's no fun. We can perform a small prank. Let's murder the teacher. <laughs> we'll just laugh it off. Do you have a marker? I have this one with me. Jesus, I think I just had an aneurysm on the left side of my head. Or a normal one, or a permanent one. It'll make it even awesome. If they're either going to frame the weird guy and or prank the weird guy himself. Either way, he's getting pranked. You mean more awesome. Shut up. Don't correct me. Hell yeah. It's more awesome. Let's do it. 
Let's do it. Let's do it. Well, what are you planning on doing? Hmm. I have an idea. Check this out. I walked over to the whiteboard and started writing. Mr. Shoji noted that he has a great assignment for us. What's this? I don't get it. What would happen if you erase the erasable part? It would mean Mr. Shoji has a... Well, you could have pointed it out to me. How about a plus sign with the heart on top of it? Can I kill her? Teacher walked into the bathroom, put the books on the table. Huh, oh, what's this? I don't write this here. There's no assignments. I don't know why somebody would even think this is funny. She grabbed the rest and throw the whiteboard. Lesson. One in the world. Mr. Shoji has a great attitude. Hmm. 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 That's rather clever. I'll give you that, but now it's never gonna get away. We really need to get stuff for the principal season. It's not gonna start with. First, not this happened to Greg. I'll have something to get the video show to fix it. Right. Why would me, the teacher, have to clean it up? It's cool enough for the day. My friends either gone or participating in club activities. I wondered what to do with myself. I'd like to get home as soon as possible, but after that dream I had last night, it's so subtle to be alone. Maybe I should have some someone cold. Nope, you are strong and independent. You don't need to be walking home with nobody. Exactly. Yes. Oh no. I've been avoiding this dream since I first had the dream, but I can't keep running away just because of some part of my butt. Besides, perfectly avoiding this just makes me feel like I'm avoiding ch Cause we are, dumbass. And speaking of what's her face, I, though I knew without looking, I nonetheless turned my attention to the side of the bridge where ch was sitting alone. Ch I was looking for somebody. Oh, God. No, I'm not. Fuck you. Forget it. Yeah, I'm playing that kind of character. At long last, after a day of hiding down the wire, I made it home. I settled down and engaged my usual witchy banter with my mother and sat down for dinner. It sounds like you had quite a day, huh? Mm -hmm. It was a weird one for sure, that's okay. We all go through these kinds of days every now and then. <laughs> They're just an un unavoidable part of life. That's not reassuring, you fucking bitch. Now, now. Don't be all mopey. More importantly, you have to finish our plate. Your plate. Otherwise, you won't get any dessert. A bitch, do I look like I fucking care what you say? I'll eat the dessert and then throw the food out. And what? You can literally. This gives me no. Oh, that's a nice room. That's nice. Right here. This. This right here is nice. I want that. Give me. After polishing off my place and pl plopping one down. I, I don't know where my joke was going. <laughs> He's going straight to bed. I won't sleep well last night, so I need a, a good eight hours. Who the hell has this 2018? Who even sleeps for eight hours? Let's just hope I don't have any nightmares for once. Mm. No! A 
week went by since my last nightmare. And with the regain still of my semblance of my usual life, of course you fucking sleep 12 hours a day. I can't do that. Every day, today included, I rose from the bed with surprising ease, ate breakfast without any complaint, and headed off to school without a second stop. And also, I pooped. Without paying my path any without paying my path any real thought. Why couldn't you say without paying attention? I found myself never cross Baron. Oh, she's the brown hair, red glasses. She is barren of children. <laughs> She's stoic, bitch. Man, pff, I had to vote in the student. No wonder she has so much time to relax by the bridge. Uh, boy appears, watch. Damn it. I don't like you. Now her name is Hachi. <laughs> Obviously in deep thought. Thinking about thoughts. <laughs> High five. You weren't waiting for me, were you? You should know by now. I always beat you to school, idiot retard. Not that I don't appreciate the thought. I oh, know it's nothing like that. I was with Chin until a moment ago, but she had to leave. Chin, she's a sophomore at school. Is that so? Before, now she's gonna try and kill her. Don't be fucking rude. Oh my God, she got offended because she's, he's talking to another, oh my God, and another one. No, not always. Oh, now it's a ghost school. It's at midnight. When almost everyone is asleep. This school will be total silence for a few seconds. What? It's the son of a person crying. Um, get good and you won't be crying. The old janitor who used to work at the school would tell the kids the story right up until he disappeared. Do you believe all that? It sounds like the most cliche ghost story ever. And from what I heard, the old janitor quit his job because he found a better one. Anything is better than being a janitor in the school, I'd say. What, really? Don't crush my dreams, man. What if you're wrong? What if there's really a ghost at the school? A lost soul that's suffering. <gasps> a soul that wants to be free, but a lingering attachment keeping them from doing so. Wouldn't that be amazing for us to witness a supernatural event like that? We live in a bar normal world where nothing interesting happens except sex changes and transgendered people and and people switching left and right. That's interesting. It's the same routine every day. Don't you think it'll be a great change? Yeah, bitch. Well, that's actually a really nice approach. I don't think you had it in you, Rio. You're deeper than I thought. 
I'm getting more interested in this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And like, what if it's a girl? What if it's a girl? What if? A hot golf girl who could become my, oh my God, I hate him so much. He needs a boyfriend free girl is what he needs. And take care of everything I said just said about you. I didn't get deep. What the hell, where'd she come from? Not you too, Shiro. You heard about it? Yes, this story in particular always interested me because you know, <laughs> I'm partial to being ghost myself. She's Danny Phantom of this school. Didn't you see the white, the glowing green eyes and the, wait, here's the, the, he had glowing white hair. Danny Phantom, her, she's Danny Phantom from now on. I was trying to think of the song. Let's see, what is true? In my opinion, I have heard some people say it's true. I wanted to find out myself, but I never had the chance. Oh, I know. Why don't we come to school late at night and figure it out for ourselves? We can do that. I have a copy of the school keys. Literally, this which is crazy. I'm not going to ask how you got them. Whatever the case. <laughs> Make your job. <laughs> She's here. We got the street. She wants us to come to the school at midnight to search for a ghost. Yeah. None of it's none of my business. You two can do whatever you want. I had to accept being such a party poop, but it would be the 1999 The Bomb. Yeah, hey, Dick, this should be really interesting. These two are excited. I don't know what I have to go to. But I suppose I might as well supervise. I wouldn't want to leave Shira alone late at night with Ryu. He's not going to do anything because he's a freaking cat. Fine. We'll enact your crazy and totally not illegal plan. Woohoo. He says in a neutral voice. This is so exciting. I can't wait until tonight, said white haired girl. Are your parents going to be okay with you leaving in the middle of the night? Yeah, don't worry about me. It's fine. I have my parents are dead. If you say so. Oh, the teacher is here. Uh huh. Alright, everyone, settle down. I'm going to suplex one of you to teach you dominance. Are we going to do this shit tonight? Oh, God, we are doing it tonight. I sent the duo message every single time for a few seconds later. I'm ready. <laughs> Head out there now. Make sure everything is alright. Meet me at the school. Gates at 1130. It's going to be a maze balls. XD. All right, cool. See you then, you dumb. Mm -hmm. Right after that, I receive a text from the girl. Hey, I'm totally ready for this, Ugu. Hey, that really that emoji really suits you. No, it doesn't. A ghost suits her. You're not even trying to tell. Excuse me, I'm not trying to get with anybody. Things just keep happening. I can't control it. That emoji really suits you, Shiro. Awesome. Well, me at the school gates at 11.30. Right on. I was thinking if you have someone you can bring with you, that would be a great. What? The more the merrier. Oh, to bring more people. Well, that should be nice. Even. I'll see what I can do. Excuse me. I eventually managed to extract Yuizuma from her and Mikuma some of my phone with like a cassette under various things. I can go and fix one of them. It forced me to do that, and then I did the quick save. But I think that's, pretty much, that's not an option. Um, obviously not this idiot. 
She meant it at first, but she seems like the kind of person who isn't afraid of no shit or pretty much anything. What is the police gonna do? And then he makes that little stupid face, so what is he gonna think? These people are, are crazy if you think, oh, I'll be there in 20 minutes. You think I'm going to jump up and spring up and get up and get ready to go. You're out of your mind. I didn't walk out quietly trying not to wake my life. You could have just climbed out your window. That would have been 10 times easier. Why are you in your school uniform? Oh, shit. She actually came. And then the other girl comes and she's like, oh my god, I'm actually a lesbian. I'm going to go because the, or the white haired girl, Danny Phantom, is here. Her eyelashes are like... probably never see her because she's probably dead their eyes areas are colorful why didn't you say so because you didn't have to ask you were ready to bust it open oh yeah It's the weird guy. That's actually pretty creepy. They have those anime eyes, which I despise because it's not realistic. God damn it. And by realistic, I mean it's too colorful. Get out of here with your color. Sure, the the blah, 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 blah. it's a good thing you two brought this in the UE and I forgot to bring them. She doesn't like to be helped. Who do you want to go with, Mother Flower? Obviously, I'm going to make these two fight. Mm, no. Mm. I'm not going with him. I'm not going with her. I'm going to go with... Her, because I feel like I'll never see her again. They're to the they to love the ghost, so yeah. It's supposed to happen at midnight, so what are we doing? The light.
lights are on. Don't be a buzz kill, get buzz killed, bitch. Whatever, I'm bored of this place. Hey, where are you going? To eat some ass in the next room, obviously. Right, I have to follow her. You walked around the corridor. As I followed you. Where are we going? Oh, we're left. No! A red back moving around? Because of Luigi's Mansion? As whatever, I'm gonna look around over here into the bushes because that's where ghosts hang out in the bushes. Action bastard! For eating that ass. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Whatever. I guess it's up to. Good old Hideki to bust the, some nuts on some ghosts. I heard a lot of crap. I away. Nothing's here. Nothing. No towards me. Did you find something, Hideki Gumshoe? <gasps> like the fucking Phoenix Wright games, I think. Wait, what? I checked my shoes to see if I was trying anything. Just face it. We aren't going to fight any. Just as I was talking. She was interrupted by the sound of bushes moving. The farch was that. Why would you grab my hand, bitch? You're the you're the oh, I'm so tough one. Don't leave me alone. I mean I wanna come with you. Yeah, uh huh. You were the first one to wanna kick a door down. Ah, uh, whoa. Haha, uh -huh, just a cat. Haha. Uh -huh. huh. I'm pretty afraid of pussies myself. Let go. Yeah, you're a big old cat lover. Just like you like the Danny Phantom over there. Maybe there's more to her than I thought. I bet you she drinks Capri Suns without the straw. What the hell are you doing? She's just staring at me like, like what the heck are you doing? Just staring at me like that. I zone out for a second there. You're pretty ugly. Uh -huh. Let's get back to the others now. As they don't find a ghost and we wasted my time. There you are. Did you find nothing? No, 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 no. Kiss my ass is what you want. We didn't find anything in the courtyard either. Even so, we still have five minutes before midnight. That's right. Let's wait here a little longer. Let's just sit in the frickin' hallway. It's that girl, obviously. Yeah. That's nice, just leave me to do it. That fucking sound effect. One of the boxes fell over, but how? Just then I felt a hand on my left shoulder. <laughs> what the heck? What the age? 
course it's her. That was so easy. Wasn't she being so cold? He's gonna scream and run down the hallway, anime style. You gotta play that out way better than that. I thought she was her and her was her. Hmm. She, uh, she couldn't have locked none to the doors and it would have been fine. We should get her home out. Oh, I hate her. I walk with you. Goodbye, you two. Bye, idiot. No! Oh my god, I don't want to spend time with her. Oops. <gasps> oh my gosh, she's 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 that term. She's Sundare or whatever it's called. They did this on a Monday. You could have did this on a Saturday and, and, and had the rest of the day off. Y'all crazy. Yeah, now when you get home, you talk about her. What a day. Quick save. Alright, I'm gonna end it right here because my ass has to do my hair. But thanks for watching. I'll continue this next Saturday. Well, Sunday. Because I work Saturday. So, um, um, see y'all. Thanks again.